Hey, Professor Homa, back to EX4, getting ready to upload our first HTML file and an image. And again, we're going to be doing more with this, but the first part is just doing our HTML. And this is what it looked like, and everything was fine. My links all worked. Uh, that's a visited link. I'll just check and see if they work. There's Breaking Bad. And notice the back button's grayed out because it opened a new tab. So I'll just close it, and then I'll check out Dexter. And that way, if people see my list of shows that I like, they can check out and see what they are and see a little description of them and I don't need anything here. So uh, everything looks okay from what I see and I'm gonna upload it so I can actually close this up and you wanna make sure that you know you do a command S or a control S or whatever you need to do that you save this um, in brackets and you don't necessarily have to close it but I'd recommend closing it up. So if you're gonna close this up um, typically if you mouse over you'll get a little X there. I'll, try, I'll do it some other recordings in Windows to see if it does exactly the same thing. But I'm going to go over here and I'm going to close this up. And that's all I need right now. I, I could keep this here. I don't have to quit out of brackets. But I'm going to go to Cyberduck on the Mac. And I'm going to launch Cyberduck. And it should just open my window and I should see all my my um, directories. I have your directories in there too. So when I can put, I can put things in or I can check your directories uh, rather than always going on the browser. Or if there's any problems, I could get to your files and I could fix them or help you fix them. Um, but let me see my if I have my directory here. Here's my bookmarks, and I'm looking for student sample, and there it is. So I'm gonna double click this one, and I have to put in my password, um, which is gonna be your last name 230, all lowercase, and that should log me in. There's that little green thing, and there's my directory that's here. Now if I go to ex4, there's nothing in it right now, and I could just go to my finder or however you want to see your folder so that you could see it. Uh, you just kind of want to get them side by side, and then all the all that you have to do. Here's my EX4. Now, I don't want my pre art being uploaded, um, and you know, we may figure a way to do this because right now it's easier just to drag your EX4 here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to move my pre art over here, out of there for the time being, and maybe we'll find a separate place for pre art so we don't have to deal with this every time. So. Uh, but what I really want to upload is EX4. Now, I could just highlight these things and drop them in the EX4. I could do either way. I could highlight these files, and I could drop them right in my EX4 folder. I could do that. And it's asking for my password again. That's okay. And it uploaded my image. So everything's there that I need, my index file and my images file. I could close this up, and I'll just check that it's there. And there it is. And... You know, I could have done the whole file too. I could have just taken this EX4 and dropped it over here. And there I'm just uploading the whole and here's here's what's nice. It says you already have an EX4 here. Do you want to overwrite it? So, you know, this kind of protects you from overwriting something you don't want to overwrite. Now I'm going to hit continue and I do want to overwrite it. Okay. And it looks like everything's there. Now to go check this out. Now I'm going to go on a browser and check it out. Everything should be should be up right now, ready to look at on a browser. So I'm going to go to a browser and check this out. It's wcccgraphicwebdesign.com uh, slash students. And if you go to slash students, it should show you a list of all the students for this class. And that way you could click on your link. Here's student sample. That's me right now. So I'm going to click on it. And there's my home page. This is the one I put in there for you. Everybody has one of these home pages. So if you're like, whoa, where's my... Where's my other thing? Now I can go to this, and this should be pre-linked to EX4, so let's check it out. And there it is. Everything's uploaded, and you can see the whole path here. WCCCGraphicWebDesign.com, it's in the students directory, which is in sample, which is me, and then you have your EX4 folder. So for all your other exercises, you're going to have EX5, EX6, um, and, and you'll add things to the EX4 folder as well. We'll put some CSS in here, and you could try it live. See how, click on your lost, and everything works. So everything should work the way it the way it was set up, but now it's now I can go see it and everybody else could go see it and it's up live. So this is your first HTML that you upload and hopefully, you know, you, you get used to doing this the first time after you do it one time, it'll be this'll be easy.